as y'all can see, Donald Trump border wall construction company. Yeah, y'all know it. Let's go, Brandon. I got to say this real quick. And this may not be too popular, but it's not toward everybody. This is not toward everybody. This is just for those Cal and Crappernick people. What Callan Krapernick did toward his mother and father is disgusting and disgraceful. Those people took him in when his biological parents put him up again for adoption. Now, here's something a lot of people don't know. Callan Krapernick is not black. He's biracial. Just like Barack Obama He's on the lighter side. His daddy black. Mama was a 19 year old girl. White girl. Why is it. Such importance. For these. Biracial people. To totally disrespect. Their white side. For in favor. For their black side. You do understand. You have white heritage and black heritage and your white heritage is not less than your black heritage and your black heritage isn't less than your white heritage so why the need to constantly try to be this black and black black and black and black black why well, they said if you got a drop of black blood, you black. You do understand the people who said that were racist and slave owners, right? You do understand that. Whenever you quote that, if you got a drop of black blood, you black. You're quoting slave masters. So you so stupid. You're quoting slave masters to justify your own self-hate towards your half of yourself. If you got a drop of black blood, no, that ain't what they said. You got a drop of Negro blood, you Negro. That's what they said. I mean, you have to be the dumbest people I see. You totally disrespect your white ancestry. Why? Why? I, I don't get it. Because that's the new cool thing to do. So if your mother's white and most likely, you know, single parent home, you know, born out of wedlock because the statistics are there. If the father's black and the mother's white. Statistically, you are a 80% chance of being born out of wedlock and an 83% chance of single parenthood. So those numbers are wild. But somebody tell me, and of course that's not everybody there. There are many black men that are married to white women and their relationships are beautiful. Mar married, still married, raising some of the most beautiful children you can ever have. But my point is why the need to disrespect the white side? You notice, I'm going to tell you right now. You don't see this with black mothers and white men. You don't see biracial children act that way. If the father's white and the mother is black, you don't see that. You only see it when the mother's white and the father's black. And oh yeah, just to let you know the numbers, when the mother is black, and the father is white, single parenthood is 30%, and born out of wedlock is 20 something. So, black women, you may not like it, but black women seem to score better with, with marrying my white guys. But let's stop this hate, okay? If you're biracial, be proud of it. Your parents loved each other enough to create you.